Hey folks, welcome back to, wow, Manor Lords, but this is our, oh, what would you even call it? Our little crossroads called Samwise. <laughs> it doesn't even have a house yet. Alright, so these guys just got started. It's a rough start in the winter, it really is. We've got the settlers, well, I guess the, the homeless people's tents. The settler's camp over here. And we did get the... They're kind of hiding in here. The... There you are. The granary done. Hiding in the trees. And I already took a family back out of there. They brought their bread in. Got a family into here. They're bringing the rest of their stuff in. Otherwise, we need to get the... Where are you? Right there. Logging camp. Highest priority. And what? The forager won't be even running until berries are are you know in the spring so we can take you down to low um what else is important here hunt let's get the hunters up one notch and not much else we can do until the logging camp is built and we actually start getting some logs in we we spent the whole uh, the whole load so that's that's done so these guys just need to turn along and do their stuff we need to be aware of when the logging camp gets finished. Hunting camp's done. Ah, okay, well that one didn't have any materials to bring over. Let's get a family in there and get that started. Hunting limit of 10. We've got a just a load of 20 in here, so it's not going to take them long to hunt that down, unfortunately. But everyone's going to concentrate over here in the logging camp, and hopefully we'll notice the... Uh, uh, the notice that it's ready. Let's head back over to Gandalf. As I was editing the episode last time, I realized I had made the plan of buying sheep and then changed my mind, but I left the family in there. So now we have a family available. Um, by now, we should be pretty much done with our... Let's see. Our wheat is, has been turned into grain. Our grain has been turned into flour. It's all gone. Our flour has pretty much been turned into bread. There's only one flour left in the system. So we should be able to pull a family out of here. We don't need a family in here. We don't have one. And pretty soon we're not going to need a family in here. One more load of flour and it's done. Uh, Samwise supplies are being harmed. The stones are, are dissolving over there in the snow. Mm -hmm. uh, stalls in Samwise. Okay, because there's a hunting camp now. I'm trying to get to this one. We have bread in here. We have one flower. Oh, is a flower there? But there's also a flower. Well, there was. Now it's a bread. <laughs> All right. Once this flower goes away, we'll shut you down and get another family back. Although they are running a food stall, there is that to consider. But I think we're going to be okay. Otherwise, how are we doing here as far as building materials? Three timbers. Wow. Why are we so low? We haven't been building that much. I want to get a bunch more tier twos in here. Uh, logging camp, one family, five timber sitting there now. So what is the issue? Um, number of number of planks, 63. Ah, apparently the alteration I did between the saw pits and the small stable worked. <laughs> They're churning out planks like crazy now. Okay, well. <clears throat> I was going to say we could turn these back on and get to work on, uh, what was that one? Logging camp. Let's go over there. And brigands. What? I guess that all happened at once. Logging camp. Oh, this thing bounces around. There we go. Let's get, let's get two families in there. I don't think there's much more to build besides the, where am I? Oh, boy, that spun me around backwards. Yeah, besides the forager's hut. Uh, yeah, it'd be nice if there was some kind of a drop-down list with all of the uh, the building projects listed by priority or something like that. Hopefully more listing and, and reporting and information gets brought into the game over time. I'm, I'm guessing it will. Um, I don't think there's anything else set to build. We, I think we spent every log that we owned to get to this point. So you guys are doing that, and we have a bandit camp somewhere. And we haven't even had a, another ruler's army fire yet. So, which is probably going to come out of here. So, let's get moving before he even realizes what's going on. 
You guys are... Boy, they're close to this edge. Yeah, they're in here. They're always above. Yeah, well, they're not really high ground too much this time. We want to take the battle into this area. They're going to come downhill to us. Get back there. <laughs> Where do we want this battle to be? I'm not seeing any advantage anywhere. So we're pretty level. So I guess it's just going to be in this area. Uh, we're paused here. Yeah. Let's get you guys heading into here. Do we go at a full run? Over here we would have some advantage. We would. Let's go at a full run for now. Until we know what's going on. Like so. I'm going to go like so. And see if suddenly the, the uh, Baron's uh, troops figure things out. Family wants more stall space. Stocks being damaged. Really, we're not getting any kind of response. Am I missing something? I don't see him over here. There's no army forming over here. Ah. I didn't set him for run, did I? Right there. And there we are. So we're at a walk. Let's leave it that way for a bit. Well, darn. I don't know if he's suddenly going to pop in. And he's going to be right here. I just don't know. Let's run for a while. Let's kick us up to maybe 20% fatigue. Okay. So how quickly are you guys actually making logs? What does this mean? Logging camp, zero. And over here, zero. Okay. You are dropping trees, though. We just got to haul them in, basically. Did we... Let's see here. We do have two oxen in this this area. And are they... No, none of them are actually sitting in place. So I assume one is up here in the woods somewhere. Let's hit tab and see if we can see this a little better. Uh, pulling over. There's one over here. You're delivering goods. Okay. And did the other one arrive? Maybe that's the issue. Oh, he's over here. He's, he's being delivered? He's being delivered. There we go. You are Peter the Ox and the unknown merchant delivering Peter the Ox. I see. Do we lock him in to a logging camp? There's pros and cons there. And while I'm talking, our fatigue is building, I know. Um, back I'll pause. To lock him in means he will bring logs in quickly until we have satisfied our, our storage and take the families out and forget that he's locked in and then he's just kind of sitting there when we realize two episodes later he could have been hauling all these other logs to all these other things so yeah it's kind of kind of a tough call there especially when you're this small you kind of need him to do this and to do everything else at the moment there's not much else to do so let's go ahead and do that let's lock a a Friedling in and you can help with over there. All right, so we are heading to this corner I'm there. I am still no hint of another army coming at us Okay, let's drop into I lost you you're over here somewhere you guys drop back to a walk you have Accumulated 28 fatigue. So let's slow you down Get you over here and then once you trigger in fact, for that matter, and if we're not going to get uh, notification that someone else is going to beat us to the punch, then let's get you guys over here somewhere. Just trying to figure out how far away. You're there. Zoom up a little bit. They can trigger about as far as here. It seems like what they were doing last time. So if we... Let's take you guys' control to here and up. All right, and let's drop you in here. That should trigger them, and we'll sit there and rest. Yeah, we'll see. We'll see how that goes. That last notification was this guy, Clay Furnace, just came in. I think that was the last thing being built. Now, have we helped ourselves by making that change? Still two. Um, actually, I didn't make any change. We talked about it, then I one off on another subject okay two logs we need more logs to come in let's first of all just fire another family or 
two, or did we maybe just log ourselves out? That might be a two. Um, you and what do I want here? Advanced and work area. We were trying to clear this road and trying to do it more strategically by not chopping everything down. I think I'll let the woodcutters camp take care of this. Let's get into some uh, more significant logage here. Where to? Let's go back here a little bit where it's not really seen. Kind of buried in the forest and do something like that and then pull out grab a road and send you into here for the loggers road and wherever they grab a tree they'll hit the road and roll on in so you would probably benefit then from this road connecting like that um yeah i think that looks pretty good yeah, I probably should have clipped the corner, but yeah, that'll work. So that'll draw them into here and then drop in. Or actually, if I was, you know, a little wiser. Mm-hmm. Yeah, let's do that. Let's grab a road from here. Kind of come out like this. And there's somebody walking around in there. Just like that. Okay. And who did I see in there? I hear I hear an axe. I saw someone walking through the snow. Huh. Yeah. Chasing that sound. There you are. <laughs> oh, that tree went down. It's Hans the woodcutter. Debranching a tree. Though right now he's reconsidering his life. There he goes. Okay. So what is next? Let's go check on our, our little troop here. All right, so you're over here. There is still no competition for this bandit camp. Okay, well, this looks good. Um, fatigue at this point is back to we were 28, now we're at 26. So you guys come into over here and rest for a little bit. So drop in like so, and just in case they actually trigger there, uh, we'll put you in formation and set you for stand your ground and. Just give you a little while. Hopefully they'll get there. Won't trigger them quite yet. They'll get a chance to rest a little. Then we'll move in that last that last half inch of the map. I thought I heard a noise. Uh, treasury, we rolled into February. Okay. So Forager's Hut finished. Don't need it yet. Clay Furnace, we were kind of there when yeah, we didn't quite get there. So Wood coming in. We've got two families in there now. Let's make three families until we get... Uh, Get caught up a little bit. We're at zero timber, so let's three families into there. We have nobody building, but there's there's nothing to build. I was going to set all these to create tier twos, but I guess we need to uh, need to get ahead on our building supplies for a little while. You guys over here for making clay roof tiles, which we don't really need at this point, but as we start upgrading all of our tier twos to tier threes, we're going to need I think it's four uh, roof tiles four flats four pallets of roof tiles for each uh, each one of those upgrades that last thing was family start moving in to gandalf samwise construction finished forager hut let's head back over there you are here there you are so over here do we have logs we have nine timber great so let's think about housing for these guys and mm, we're, we're going to be getting negatives for not having houses. But there is something to be said about quickly putting up a farmhouse and getting a, a, a field in. And getting that thing planted as fast as we can to start this year's crop since this is our breadbasket. And really what we need is a whole bunch of barley. Mm, that really is something to think about. Show me barley again. Barley is... Okay, show me flax. Flax was in that area, so barley could be anywhere else. Barley could be up in here. It could be... There could be a field set here afterward. That's probably half a Morgan. So we can have a field over here right now. And then we'll, we'll f fill that in later. And then we'll do the flax over here after that. But let's get a barley field set. And think about the logistics of that. You... To there. Hmm. If I put a road in there, I wouldn't have to use that point. 
There is that. So memorize that. Right there. You're somewhere around like that and like that. Right? Um, why can't I get into my building mode? That's weird. B didn't work. Uh, barley. Kind of like that. So we need to start over here and end right there. Leave that existing road. Do this. Come around. Something like that. Heading into here. Follow the old pathway. Right like that. Build. And then just delete the one under it. There we go. B. Oh, it's not B for build. It's C for construction. Mm, okay. Okay. So, barley. Yay, look at that. Now I can set a barley field that does something like this, and it will follow the road. So I don't need that other point. Really nice. You're there, and you're there. There's 1.4 Morgans. Wow. Okay. Um, maybe not that far. Let's go to here. We'll put another field over there after that. A lot of this is going to be field. Um... That looks pretty good. And take that same footprint and kind of work through this area so we can put buildings on both sides of this main road out to here. So it'd be out in this area. Yeah, I think that works pretty good. 1.0 Morgans, sure, we'll go with that. You're there. The barn goes, no, not the barn, the farm. Let's do that again. Flax is there. Barley is there. This area is not being used at all. So the farm goes in there. Do I have enough to put a farm up? Um, I think I had nine, yeah. So if you went here, you would be... Wow, oh, it did snap. Okay, so you're going to be like so... Oh, there's a building in there. All right, so you're over here. And I could do this without chopping a tree down. Okay, so you're going to be something like that. And I just realized that I was paused through all that. Okay, so you're here. Uh, we are in February. We're going to get that built. We're going to get this built. Highest priority. Once that is done, we could then put in housing. And maybe we'll have one person building how Two people building houses. Three people planting. Families planting. Abandon all the other jobs. Go to war. Yeah. So, houses... And wonder what interesting shapes we would get out of a road system like this. You are the hunter. So I went down a little bit. Thump thump. What's the thump thump? Family moving in to Gandalf. Uh, family members joined. Okay. All right. H. House. And it's not at quite, quite at the hunter's camp. But let's come back a little work around. Can I go further? No. You only get two... Nope, that didn't work. There. Why do you do that? Stay. Dude. Okay. Let's start here. There. Oh, it did stay. That's strange why it does that balance. But if you went to there and down... Do we go further? Let's oblong in a little bit there and rotate you. What do we have here? That's interesting. Big garden area there. Take you down a notch. Still big garden area. Down one more notch. Two big garden areas. Well, hmm. Don't know that we're going to need concentrate too much on garden areas if we're going to have all the uh, the food grown over here let's although that being said that answers our vegetable needs for a long long time <laughs> hmm plus plus but that gets that's five homes right there that gets us going am i running i'm kind of running while i'm jabbering well, although we got to build the farm so i guess it doesn't matter um 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 um, um. let's go with that Set you. You're next. Let's get this cut down. So, forestry. Did I set an area? I don't think I did. Let's give you an area of here. That was the idea. Take all the trees out in... Okay, zoom in. In this area for our farming. And then you move into the forest. So, you're going to cut down at least that. 
and at the moment two families in one building I think that's the best we're gonna be able to do all right there was another thump uh, Burgage plot we're over here settled in oh good okay so how are we doing in this area um, tab only one two so you and you get to work over here um, what does that mean that means we're replacing you two so minus minus and you reassign to uh, did I not see that properly Okay, tab. Boy, I thought I saw a one right there. It's just you. Okay, well, just you then. So, people, and you can work here. Next one that comes in will work there as well. It did not reoccupy one of those booths that were in there. Interesting. And, uh, oh, by the way, we have troops out there, don't we? Yeah. So, if I had forgotten about them, they were in... A position to be able to to defend themselves if we had to what does our flag look like all right I'm not sure who that represents but it's pretty cool all right so you guys are rested enough where do we want this battle because they're gonna be coming at us here momentarily they're running downhill so to, to give them the least advantage is at least catch a level playing field unless we could run a circle around them how oh, boy there just isn't anything that's uh, stark en en enough to give us the high ground we're pretty level out here okay so let's just move you guys into here 10 wide or, or 12, 12 wide or 6 wide hmm it worked last time at 12 wide it worked so let's do that you guys are rolling in and we are set for stand your ground it spreads their guys other guys out too and I think it works okay so you're heading in you're already coming at us all right so it's it has been triggered is there any advantage let's just drop right here go there stand there for a while finish resting Get your cohesion up. There's a cohesion of 22. I still... I, I, I get it, but I, when I move them around, they don't seem to be consistent. I can put them in a tight column, and it goes up, and then it goes down, and then it goes up. and So what are we going to officially drop into here? Plus 16. Fatigue is dropping. Still plus 16. Okay. Well, it seems to have locked in there. Um, out of curiosity. So if I set you up like this. Plus 16. Plus 16. So maybe it has more to do with multiple troops backing each other up rather than a single group. It's possible. A lot of these are really meant for an army. You know, multiple troops doing you know things around each other and backing each other up so now we're at a plus 15 <laughs> we lost ground there effectiveness is 112 they're on their way in yeah I don't think there's anything I really need to control at this point so let's drop in ahead of time there we are spin around where are the I hear them oh that's a spooky sound Where are they? There they are. Right in front of me. You can hear my footsteps in the snow. Alright, we're over here. Let's let's get on this side of the battlefield. Yeah. Got my cane there. I can defend myself a little bit. <laughs> see this thing firsthand now I'm pretty sure I'm invisible to them right I can walk right through yeah I'm a ghost so we can watch this thing right from 
within. Now, I don't think I can pause. No, I cannot pause. So, what happens, happens here. Alright, throw some shade out there, guys. Here they come. Still in the air. And they have given up. Oh, those last plunges. Yeah. Game saved. And we won. Great. We're still at 12. It's working well. You guys, my I am. Let's find where I am. I'm going over here. Okay. You guys pop in. And take care of that. You can walk. And we're good. So. And they're coming in as a unit. Nobody stayed behind. Wonderful. Cohesion or negative two, though. And I'm not sure why. They're packed together tighter than they were in that line. But that was fun. All right, so that is done. I am over here. We haven't really taken the time to walk through what what might be Gimli, but I'm still waiting to see if there are any other uh, inspired suggestions that hit the comments before we move into here. There's quite a hill. I like that. Yeah. Quite a hill there. Any other interesting features? Oh, this one has the... The collapsed windmill. And whatever this was, a farm building of some kind. Interesting. Uh, pull out, so that's the edge of this land. And here, a lot of these little animal trails. The light gray ones. And lots and lots of forest. Okay. So, over here, you guys were logging up here. And how you doing now? Eight sitting there, 12 unaccounted for. We're kind of back in business again. So we could put our two families. We're in February. Ah, let's not. In fact, let's spend this time setting up more uh, farming. So we did a round of farming in this plot. Let's see if that was, that was Emmer. Look at that. We're no longer functional at least to this level fertilization wise yeah we could run another one out of here we're not going to get near as much out of it if we went to flax it's about equal barley's even worse so whatever nutrients were there for flax weren't disturbed by the usage of emmer hmm Okay, but let's fallow this one. I've never run the game long enough to fallow. How do I crop tie? Oh, you're already planted. Oh, okay. Then after this one. So if I were to do that, what happens? Second year is fallow. Third year. We'll try wheat, but it may end up being fallow too. So in that case, let's go ahead and set these guys up. We've taken out all the trees we want to take out. I want to leave this. I'd love to get a few more planted around here. Um, I think these are all ready to do as well. So we're in February. We have a log down. No, that's a road. Let's pull you two out. Uh, that one and that one. Okay. Anything else to pull out of here? No. Okay. So you field, build, construct, farming, field. There we are. So let's grab from this corner... I guess down to there just to make it interesting. So let's make that last then. Um, up to this point, to there, and like that. There's a, there's a Morgan. We'll go with that one. 
right there, build you, and then take you around. You won't wrap. Why will you not wrap? Okay, we'll do you last. So this divides in half somehow. So we are here. I guess we're there. To let's leave this opening. Well, maybe to there. And there's always noises when I'm in this mode. To there. Okay. So you are four points. And let's go from here. Somehow. Yeah, that looks good. To there. You're following. But I can't tell where my pointer is now. To there. To there. There's another Morgan. Okay. So there's four fields. And you're going to be wheat. Let's go. Go ahead and crop rotate. Wheat, fallow, and wheat. But I don't know if that if we're going to need two fallows to make this work. We don't have a lot of fertilization in this area. So you, same thing at the moment. Uh, fallow, wheat, and then rotate into fallow and then wheat. We're not even going to try the other crops over here. It's just not, uh, not enough. So rotate. You're going to be wheat, fallow, wheat. We should be... Theoretically, kind of alternating these things. So two are fallow and two are wheat at, at any one time. That actually would be wise. Um, yeah. Let's do this one. Am I there? There. So you are going to be fallow, and then you will be wheat, and then you will be fallow. Okay, we'll, we'll try that one. I don't know how well it actually works. And I don't know how well burning boosts the fertility afterward. This is the first time that I've been here to notice something like this. Oh, that's what the noise was. I just realized they just hit the camp to notice this. So if I had burnt it, it would have gone back to that. Mm. And if I burn it first thing in the season, plant, plant it in the fall, let it grow that last little bit of fall, the very first part of spring, and then burn it, is that enough to bring it back and then start planting for the normal year? Huh. So many unanswered questions. You are right now going to bring in just 15. But you are only... Oh, you're already at 44. So you're not going to bring in much. But do we waste it by burning it? Because food is already getting a little touchy around here. So let's pull out of that and think about things. But I need to... No? Family members join and constructed a farmhouse. We're over here. So let's deal with this. Let's pull everybody out of the logging camp. Let's pull everybody out of the hunter. Over here. Minus. Um, pull everybody out of the st stockyard, stockhouse, storage, warehouse. This thing. Storehouse. Pull you out of there. We will leave one family building. We'll leave, we'll put three, okay, let's think about this. Three should be enough to get that done really quick. And that does happen in February, oh, in March. Okay, never mind, they can't even start. Well, I don't think they can start. We'll put one in there. And we'll leave, no, we'll wait till March. We'll leave all five out and let them put these manors up as fast, these burgages up as fast as they can. Maybe we can defeat this sooner than I had expected. That's possible. We'll give them the two weeks or so to get that going. Alright, so we've got... I saw snow. Pull back into here. You are fuel for burgage plots. We... Yeah, fuel. Fuel is a problem. Yeah. We didn't put in the firewood cutter, did we? Um, I still have... I have 16 timber. They've been doing a great job hauling in logs. And this is where the... What I had mentioned by our one ox being trapped here while there's nobody working the camp. Yeah, have to remember that. All right, so let's quickly do the firewood right there. Woodcutter's Lodge. Where to? This is cut down and it's gone. This guy is going to lay waste to this before long. I think you're all the way out here. I think you are. I think you're kind of right in here. 
Uh, uprooted. Let's turn you... Let me think about that. How did you work? I think you pop out of that area right there. So if I set you in, how deep can I go? I guess that's where we're at. Into there? Right there. You're in there. And let's grab a road. And pop you... How do we connect? I don't know. I guess right now we just connect here. Okay. And let's come back to that. Let's see how we're doing over here. You guys... What you doing? Just kind of making yourself home here, huh? Yeah. Uh, dudes, can we... Thank you. <laughs> Ah, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You gotta lead them by the hand sometimes. Alright. Well, this goes into the treasury. And you guys get into position for the next time we need to do this. But, when is that next time and how's it done? I guess he's gotta be in the center here. I think he does. That was there. The next one could very well be, like, there. Or there. Yeah, you just never know which end they're gonna pop in. So I think we're back into this area. We'll set you guys in here. So walk into this area right here and huddle up and stay warm. And not at a run. Okay, we're good. You guys are doing that. I am unpaused now. And how do we get from... I'm lost. There I am. From this area out to here. Do we go... I, th I assume we go around the flax field. Or we go through the center of it. Let's think about that. Uh, construct flax. That is how many Morgans. Your tree down. So let's do something crazy and make one monster field from there. You don't like that. Let's go there. You will not grip. Okay. And there's a noise I need to check out. Uh, Samwise Burgish Plot Belt. Okay. We're still in February. Try that again. And a new message. Dudes! We receive reports of a band of raiders roaming the nearby lands. Should we track their steps? Hmm. Now, if I say yes, then it'll give us another year. If I say no, we're ready. They may start attacking right now. What have we got? We've got 20 of our normal militia. We've got 12 of our retinue, but they're they're too far away. Let's let's take the year. Track their movements. Okay. Otherwise it doesn't say what happens, but I'm pretty sure that means they'll uh, they'll jump in right now. Now we've got a countdown. So let's get this done and let's think about how to increase our twenty to thirty six or even better. So and maybe still be able to keep the retinue out there. Yeah. We could put a garrison in and double our retinue, but I don't think we can split them into two groups. So we would just be a group of 24. Um, I need to see the flax. Okay, that's what I was doing. So I need you, and let's just go from there to roughly there to there. Boy, it's hard to... There it goes. There it is. We're three Morgans. So we could divide this in three, or thirds, with a road. That's what I was trying to get at. This guy could cut through. And if I do that, what does that do as far as fields go? You, Flax, what are you? You're point eight. So if I were to take this road just a little bit further over. Road. There. 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 Okay. And road. Alt. Hit you. Remove. Alright, so that's how my road cuts through. And continues on through. To curve around. Let's see, the stone was there. That was there. Let's curve you around like this actually a little too far there 
and then work our way right into that. Okay, that works. Last noise was three houses? Where are we at? One, you're in. Let's spend the money on the vegetables. Let's do that, and as soon as that's done, let's kick your priority up. Or is that up? Are we done? There's no building there. Okay, then let's set the other house. What am I not miss not seeing here? General people. That's the okay, there it is. I thought it was you know house for house, but it's it's a people for a house. Expand living space. And you can go up as well. Wow! Shot me to the moon. Okay. So that's gonna give us five houses. I've lost myself here. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, and five. That's five houses. We are in March. Do we do it? I think we do it. I think we do. So farm is over here. Let's five, 13, zero. Let's do it. Let's put four in here real quick. One can continue building. Four can get this planted out really quick. And I think we put in one more. So you guys were cutting this. You're not there yet. Can we get... You pull out you, that, and barley. Yes, we can. We're going to sacrifice a little bit there. But let's take you... Let's take this road out further. And something like that. What's that look like? You there, barley. That looks pretty good. Take you out to something like that. Shoot you through... There's point eight. Let's take you further in. There's one. Let's do that. I don't think we're going to lose any trees. No, we didn't. All right, there's two of them. You're going to be barley. And you're going to be barley. And that gets them working. Uh, Gandalf just had something. New family moving in. New mercenary companies. Treasury. Uh, family joins. I think we're okay there. All right, so these are going, did we get, what do we do with this? Can we just go without firewood for a while? Will they actually move out? Uh, freeze to death is, I'm sure, is a problem. We came with firewood, though. Didn't we? What's in the storehouse? Storehouse. We have 18 firewood. Okay, let's get you guys going. You're high. You're high. You're very high and and no they're not hippies um you are medium you can be the last one okay let's call this area done i think so let's look at people's people's are sewing plowing by hand who's sewing <laughs> okay you're not sewing you, you you were just joking you're really plowing by hand all right so they're all on their way and they're doing their thing over here so any other messages? This one scares me. Work area. Our berries are dead. They're not coming back. Hmm. Something broke there. And I don't know what to do about that. We still have one family in place. Uh, follow the road. There you are. So one family's been here running a, uh, a market stall this whole time. I don't know if we're going to get these running again if there's no berries, but the berries have died. And I do not know why. They're showing them. But we're still 0 of 64. Seasonal growing. Well, we'll give it a few weeks and see if that becomes like 20 of 64. But at the moment, I'm, I'm, I'm a little worried. So, exposed goods, storehouse. What is that? Is that the remainder of the stone over here so we're waiting for yeah there is a rolling problem with the uh, <laughs> with the zoom we're waiting for probably these guys we gotta think about f plowing over here too so that's the storehouse it is two families not enough to get everything in all right so pause we need to get ourselves figured out here as far as being able to get the farms going and we don't have our our official farmers up and running over here you guys do what for a living you are a granary worker i really don't want to disturb that um peoples you're a tanner there's only one tanner right 
You are follow that road there. Just one tanner, so we don't want to disturb that either. I guess we're not going to have the ideal working conditions this time. Let's just figure out who we can drop out like all the planks. So you guys can go away. You guys can go away. Uh, logging camp, two of you can go away. There's seven. And I need like two more. We don't need anybody in any of these guys. Although I would like to get the bloomery going. Yeah, you're up and running. We've already made some iron slabs. Mm. We need some. We need some spears, and we've got the ability to make them. But we're now going to take more families away, and we're all we're trying to make more families. Okay, so you're all there. We don't need to be doing any more mining for a while. So you guys can come out. We've got probably quite a bit backed up, right? Fifty-five. Okay. So there's. I need one more family out, and then we need to build a. And actually, rather quickly. Let's start at the end. You can be our first blacksmith. You will make tools, spears, and sidearms. Monies and blanks. So we've got everything we need. Let's make you work. Alright, so you're up and running. We really need to work on food. We really do. That'll probably be our first import from the other side. Be importing food to get this place up and running again. Okay, so you're going to do that. You're going to be the very highest priority. Once that gets going, uh, three fields worth. Let's let's go there. Let's go there. Get this guy built. And once he pops, we'll put another family in there or both families in there. No, one will go away. There's only going to be one more. Who else can we raid? Um, communal oven is done. We're out of flour. You're done. Yep. Uh, small stable. You guys, we have two families in here. Because one was so busy doing other things that they would never bring anything over here. We've got more funds. So we did manage to sell something. Let's look at that. We were trying to sell arms. Which one was it? Was it not commodities? What were we selling? We were selling small shields. We got a whole bunch of small shields. And follow the merchant. Now you are... Pull out. Pull out. Nothing. So it's not our merchant. It's not one of ours. Okay. So you guys, people, are any of you transporting, mounting a horse, mounting a horse? The so two of you are getting ready to go do something. Let's sit here for a while. They're going to start plowing and sowing. You're going to be upgrading. I can see people walking in there right now, so they're probably doing just that. I guess I can move around. Yeah, they're banging on that. So we get 20 slabs of iron. That should give us 20 spears. It's probably a one for one. Um, mounting a horse, pedaling. So pedaling means what? Uh... No. No. Peddling means you're actually peddling in our markets. Okay. Peddling current tense. So I guess you're on your way to peddling. Alright. So mounting a horse, mounting a horse. I'm waiting to see what these mean. And if I click you, let's just move you. That'll pin you. Ah, we can do that. So you are going for a horse. You are going for a horse. You've got a horse. You've just set up your own trading wagon, and I am stuck in a building. There we go. So this, I want to see the process. What actually happens here? You're going around. You're going to pop in the indoor, and you're going to come out the outdoor. And are we going to see uh, here? Are we going to see this move? 42? Did I say 47 last time? There's 43. I think she just dropped one off. We have another horse coming in. So 43 does this move. I have a feeling it moved as he touched that door and we didn't see it. You're going to pop into there. 43. I didn't see any difference. I think they're making a trip but they're not doing anything. There's 44. That's in town. Okay, here. There's nothing here. How are they trading if there's nothing in here? I'm a little confused. 
Yeah. I want to see that going up. But it's almost like we're just stuck waiting for, for these guys to come in. And they don't seem to ever do anything. So where are you? You're just entering. We'll come back to you here real soon. you got to make it all the way to here. So there was a thump thump. No, it wasn't. What was that? Uh, Samwise family members join. Oh, as they're getting their houses, then people are, uh, more, more workers are, are joining. Okay, good. You are not quite there yet. We're going to, we're going to hover in here. I want to see that trader. I don't want to speed it up. Well, I could speed it up. Everything's kind of, kind of sad. Let's do that. Let's kick the speed up a little bit and, oh boy, look at them go. So they harvested. They harvested this field and it is going to go fallow. Or is that this year? See, I don't know. It's officially in this year, but I want you to be fallow. This is the one. So wheat fallow. Yeah, so you're fallow. And click on you. Oh, okay. I guess, no. What? Damn. How come I don't have to see my little bars of... Because they're still pulling it in, I guess. Okay. So they're bringing the last of that in. Yeah, I don't see my, you know, plowing and sowing and, and growing and harvesting bars. What am I missing here? Anyway, pause. Did you ever make it? So over here, trade, small, you're still, and you left. Okay. 75. Nothing happened. Hmm. That one's probably going to remain a mystery for a while because I don't know what's happening here. Fill me in if you know. We've got plenty of people. Stock goods for sale. So theoretically, they're bringing stuff in. Beatrix, she's going to get something. Hans is Hans stocking goods for sale transporting Mr. Hans, there you are okay, you coming out of what? oh, you went here to get small shields, alright so maybe there were small shields in there and he left with them and we didn't see it because I was on this tab instead of this tab and I didn't see the 20 sitting there, look at that okay so in that case maybe something actually is happening and i just didn't get to see it but there should be a hundred coins 150 coins now rolling in here real quick let's see what you do 30 becomes nothing and did we just give those away No, now it's considered generic storage? What happened there? Still 75. There's nothing inside. You are... You're the trader. You're our trader. Okay. Bingo. You are now on your way, Friedland. Trading. As well as... Nickel who went in after the 30 left and there was nothing in there so he's just making a trip for nothing yeah all right well that's kind of working now so i'm going to just be glad um through all that talking what's happened let's get over there to the other side you guys let's kill all this stuff and we've put in our burgage plots we put in all of our houses we are starting to plant gardens we don't have enough money to think about doing anything with the back ends here. You guys found firewood, and look at that. There is an old-fashioned chimney. <laughs> yeah. Boy, it'd be great if we could look inside there and see the, 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 the fire. Nah, can't see much. Anyway, that's kind of cool. There's an opening in the roof. Uh, there we are. Yeah. Anyway, so you guys are out here. You're trying to get these two going one more time. Barley and barley. These bars. I didn't see these bars on this other field. That kind of felt strange. It's still not there. So, because we've fallowed? You have it. You. Are we still bringing stuff in? No, I don't see any crop sitting out here hmm you are fallow and you don't show it either 
So it's a fallow thing. Whereas these two have it because we're doing something. Okay, so this officially is fallow now for the year. Great. What did we bring in? They didn't they won't do any threshing. We did 36 last time, we're only doing 16 this time. So there is quite a difference. Okay. Um, raiders are near. I just saw that in the corner of my eye. You are now the blacksmith. You will be making spears. Thank you. So we have... Oh, two... Oh, you've already... That's your own spears for this home. Okay. So you're going to be making spears. We want to get 16. Then we want to shift over to a 20 of pole arms. And you are tools. What hut? Cutter's hut. Oh, that's over there. Okay. So, you guys, let's go to people. What you doing? You are transporting, I assume you're transporting iron. You're bringing all the slabs over. You're coming back with iron slabs. You are picking them up, coming back with iron slabs, and that's got to be heavy. Yep. All right, so pop over to here. We just got this done with the one family. We don't need it yet. Let's hold off on that. We want food. Uh, in fact, for that matter... Hmm. Well, I've got to say we do need to provide them with clothing still. That's the last thing. Yeah, so we've, we'll have firewood figured out. We've got food coming from two sources as soon as we get going on that. We are in March. We kind of need to get going on that. Then once the farming is done, the sowing, we'll get back to tanning and everything else. All right. So you where is the you're in this area follow the road there you are get you going get some berries in and can't do this yet even if we wanted to so one family's in there four families are in here they're gonna make short order of this and be done so when they come back let's get them building the tannery so industry that's not an industry there and there and leather coming out of the of here and housings in here let's head into a place like so what do we think about that that kind of works tanner's in there and I don't remember if you can sneak out the back side we might just put a rope back down into here We'll wait till that builds. So that will be the next thing you need to do. Then we need to get hunting up and running again. Yeah, we can't do the tannery. Yep. All right. So need to come back. Remember that this is happening. And I'm feeling like I'm probably close to that one hour mark, aren't I? So where do we wrap this up? We're going to be getting spears to add to our shields to increase the, the spear militia. So we're lacking spears down there. They're going to be doing that. Are they kind of doing it now? Blacksmith, general, making spears. That's the spears that they have already for themselves. People are still transporting. So we're still bringing in all the goods. Maybe here in just a moment, we'll see the beginnings of effect. Can we get in and actually see? We haven't really stopped to look at any of these. Let's finish this episode by doing this. So she is dropping off slabs of iron. You're bringing planks in. Woo! Planks in. Maybe you're just passing through. This is, yeah, he's passing through going in this door and out the one over there or something. All right. So you are making spears. Really cool. Two of you officially are. So someone else is walking in here to use the other anvil. Okay, and then over here, that's going to be the brewer. You are an outhouse. That's the brewer. You are the... <laughs> yeah, she's making shields. Yeah, that was, that was a little embarrassing. And you are the cobbler. We can't really see what's happening in this one, unfortunately, either. And then you are the... Fletcher and again we can't really see what's happening in there so the blacksmith is the only one that puts on a really good show right there maybe they have to be actively working and I don't know you think this would be reversed maybe it's because I left such a small space back here maybe we would have gotten more of a show if I gave more room 
don't know. Okay, well that is that, and I need to be done. So, I will catch you folks next time. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye now.